use that and then they just wrap the roll around it and then cut it, you know, to have all the pieces the same. I just, I don't do it. I just cut, cut it, you know, I'll stretch it out on my, on my leg and then cut, stretch it out, cut. I don't care. All right, now for the sunburst technique, we're going to use four pieces of this mesh per bundle, but you can do three or five or whatever. It's, it's,
faster when I'm not talking. <laughs> but it's fun, you know, I can sit here and do this and watch a movie or listen to a podcast or an audiobook or whatever. It's just a lot of fun. I pull it like this. Four. Although I will recommend, um, if you have pets, I would, um, if you have to stop or if you're working on this, might want to be in a room where they cannot get into your stuff like my cats love to chew on the mesh and the ribbon and stuff so I have to do it in a room with the door shut where they can't come in and <laughs> chew on it all right we'll use this piece of ribbon here um we'll do a plain silver one I'm just gonna take one string of these sequins and lay it over the top
think it turned out better. <laughs> there you go. It is so icy and sparkly, oh my word. Look at it. It, it makes me think of like the movie Frozen or, or like an ice skating rink or something. It's so cool. just look at it and try to figure 
So pretty. 
this is not necessarily a Christmas wreath, it's just like, I could put this up after Christmas. Um, and I used to have one similar to this that I would put up after Christmas because it's just sort of a winter theme. Yeah, so 